Welcome to the GeoVital Academy. I'm excited that you're here. Okay, here we are at the uh, building site here in Thailand. So we're gonna take some measurements. There's this concept of electronic pollution. If we can reduce what people are exposed to, um, then their health is not as burdened, and then their bodies can do what they can to recover. This is Patrick Vandenberg, your global radiation specialist. All right, let's, let's do that last question first. Um, shielding paint should always be grounded. Um, well, it should be grounded when we have normal electrical wiring in the walls, in the ceiling. Um, and so unless you know specifically, like when you're building a house, um, unless you know specifically that there's normal wiring there, it should always be grounded because first of all, it's a safety feature. If the paint was to ever by accident get um, electrified, let's say you're drilling through with a power drill, you hit power cable, the drill bit, transfer that to the paint, which is electrically conductive, that can be a dangerous situation. And if it's grounded, that's why we do that, that triggers a circuit breaker and the power goes off. So yes, you should always ground it. Um, if you're building a house and you use exclusively shielded cable, then you can forgo with the grounding because there's no danger. The cable itself is protected in case there was an electric you know, short circuit. 